me see! Ah, thank goodness you're awake, or I'll have to try my last-ditch move. Emergency skills for junior patrollers. Lesson one, CPR! Ugh. Uh, never did it on any living person, though. <laughs> Chisia. Sorry, sorry. You just woke up and here I am, chatting up a storm. <sighs> Are you alright? Do you feel any discomfort? You can call me Trisha. And she's Yang Yang. We are in the gorgeous spirits. It's on the outskirts of Jinzhou, Huanglong. Your attire doesn't seem local. Are you a roving traveler from afar or someone returning home? So you don't know why you're here, where you're from? Or who you are. Baisha didn't tell us you'd have these after effects when you wake up. The wind has brought us a warning. The Atheric Sea is converging. It seems a new tacit field is taking shape. It's probably going to get dangerous here soon. Ugh, I knew it. Our gourds are out of service because of the Etheric Sea's influence. We can't send or receive messages for help now. We better hurry over to meet up with Baijiu at our gathering spot and get out of here. Guess you really can't recall a thing, but don't worry. If you got any questions, we can talk as we move. Yang Yang and I will give you the full scoop every little detail from the get-go. Rover, uh, can we call you that for now? Before you remember your true name? We shouldn't stay here. If you don't have other plans, how about leaving with us for now? The terrains are complicated here, and we usually take that one route. If you don't mind, perhaps we can leave together for now. You can decide your future plans once we leave here. Yeah, let's get going! <laughs> Rover, I know you can't remember a thing, but there's one thing I'm 90%, no, 100% sure about you. You must be a resonator too. You've got a tacit mark on the back of your hand, and you have a gourd. This is proof you're a resonator. Your gourd's design looks a bit different from the ones we use, though. Also, we have resonators who can detect the formation of tacit fields nearby, like what Yang Yang just did. She can tell all kinds of information by reading the streams in the wind. That's her resonance ability. While I couldn't feel a thing. <laughs> Plus, not many people are gonna hang out in the wilderness these days. And it may seem all nice and quiet here now, but you never know when a tacit discord might pop up out of nowhere. Oh my, speak of the devil!
shadows. Bravo! So you still remember how to fight despite having forgotten everything? Wow! Watch me lead the charge next time. No one messes with my show for... Uh, I mean, Chisha. What's wrong? Are you injured from the fight? You saw our sentinel in your memories? Yes, the one we built this statue for. The Oracle Engine Sentinel in Zhenzhou. There is one capital and six cities in Huanglong, with each city having its own sentinel. While they share some similarities in appearance, there are also differences. The sentinel in Zhenzhou is known as Jue, manifesting in the form of a long, like a statue you just saw. You were standing face to face with our sentinel? One can hardly see our sentinel with their own eyes. Most people only get the chance during the appointment ceremonies. According to your description, you stood pretty close. Only the sentinel's appointed resonator is allowed in its proximity. For now, that person is the magistrate of Zhenzhou. Chisya might be in danger. Rover, please. chance to help and Yang Yang just rushed over to protect you like a mu <clears throat> anyway Yang Yang was trying to shield you and then BAM the Tessa discord was taken care of before I could get a good look she's yeah see there's a resonance beacon over there when you see a beacon be sure to register and activate it it's usually safe within a five meter radius of a beacon it can protect you from danger sometimes Rover could he hand me your terminal for a moment? <sighs> Done. It's design and... <sighs> Done. <sighs> Done. 
Its design and system version are different from ours, but your terminal still has the data transfer and other basic functions. We are almost at the gorgeous entrance. There will be a descent, but if your terminal's glider module still work, Once you're out of the gorge, there's only a short walk to reach Jinjo. Jinjo is the safest place around here. The Resonance Nexus provides coverage for the whole city. Besides, we've got a protective barrier and strong fortifications. <laughs> right? Jinjo sits between the Deseret Highland and the Norfolk Barrens. It's a border city and a fortress. It's very crucial to the safety of Huanglong. Huh? We've agreed to meet up with Bai Zhe here. Where is she? This is the center of the Atheric Sea. Field? When did it show up? It wasn't here when we just got here. But I didn't sense a hint of a tacit field's presence. So it appeared while we weren't looking? Like in the blink of an eye? Or maybe the etheric sea can tell where we are. Could it be following us? The center of the tacit field. Isn't that Baija? Baija! Baija! We are too far away. Perhaps she can't hear us. Freshly formed tacit fields of a dormant period. During this time, it is relatively safe. My apologies. I should have said it is temporarily safe. The dormant period of a tacit field varies based on its formation time. Generally, the shorter the formation time, the longer the dormant period. However, with a longer dormant period, the tacit discords born within are usually stronger. The faster a tacit field forms, the longer its dormant period lasts. For now, this tacit field should be safe. Right. The glider can't carry us beyond the tacit field's range. Besides, Baija is there. We'll have to go down and see what is going on. Now it's time to use a glider module. Rover, let me help you activate it.
This isn't the place for talking. Let's go. before, but Rover was able to completely defeat it. Rover! What was that last move called? That looks as cool as Fiamma's killer move! That's strange. This place isn't known to be so dangerous. Anyway, come check this out! <sighs> Oh, this is an echo. Wow, an echo of the elite class. Someone got lucky today. My apologies. We got a little carried away. Does reverberation or echo ring a bell to you, Rover?
Everything in our world is made up of frequencies, and every sound generates a reverberation. Those echoes are the lingering reverberations of tacit discords after they disintegrate. We can absorb them into the data banks in our Pangu terminals. Oh, by Pangu terminal, she means the gourd-shaped device every resonator has, developed by researchers in Guanglong. But you see, it's not always we get to find these. Also, there's a limit to what your gourd can absorb. Absorption is only possible when your data bank's level is equal to or higher than the tacit discord's level. The terminal can then convert its reverberation into an echo for use in battle. My terminal issued a warning when I detected that tacit discord earlier. It should at least be an Overlord class. Rover, would you mind checking your data bank level? No need for that. Rover, why don't you just try absorbing it with your terminal? Oh, so it doesn't work. No worries. You can start with smaller ones before tackling this guy here. There should be some sweet baby roche rooms around here. Let's go check those out, shall we? <sighs> we'll need to report the unusual phenomena here to the City Hall and the Academy. Let's make our exit. resonance ability quite like this. You got any other tricks up your sleeve? Like eating a whole tacit discord? Grilling echoes alive? Could it be related to your lost memories? Can you recall anything now? Rover, are you feeling all right? Any discomfort? Could it be the side effect of fighting that tacit discord? Baiju, can we take Rover to do a checkup at Huashu Academy's Resonance Medical Department? Hmm. Baiju? Absorbing echoes with the human body is not entirely unprecedented. With the human body? I remember Comprehensive Mirror for Historians mentioned this in the Huanglong section's opening. A celestial being descended, commanding the Tiankun's boundless power. Assuming mortal form, they condensed the primordial essence, creating Pangu, cleaving heaven and earth apart. <laughs> 